The shea nut fruit is almost ready and I cannot wait. Nato, you're not the boss of me, okay? <laughs> you're filled with energy. Nato. The work for the underground water catchment is still going. These guys are going to be here for some time. We were able to call out someone who's actually very experienced in digging. His experience is that of digging for gold. So he knew exactly what it was going to take for us to get down beneath that rock to get to the clay content, where we can go ahead and seal it and begin catching rainwater. Nato, there you go. Stay with me. Come on, Nato. Just a little bit more to go. Are you okay? Come, let's go.
Tiedän oikein. Voin tulla laajaa. Arvan teoran tuu vaan kudebo. Arvan teoran tuu vaan kudebo. Kam dalim nam daljo. little local mango. Mm. When I tell you these mangoes are delicious, it was actually my first time trying it. So I just gave him a few little pieces because I didn't want to overwhelm the oatmeal. And of course I would take over the rest. Y'all, mm, mm, mm.
for lunch. Lunch? Yeah. Oh, right. You know me, I like I, I eat anything. Anything you provide because you put you already you always provide beautiful, delicious meal, so Thank I'm down you. for any meal you provide, yeah. Sometimes I need inspiration though. Do you miss like TZ? Because you know I don't know how to make <laughs> You know TZ, you know, you don't know how to do it, so no. I don't bother you with TZ. I don't Do you go sneak and eat it? No, long time I no it's been a while I don't <laughs> Oh okay. I don't eat TZ. It's been a while. Do you want me to make it one day? <laughs> no. Every time I say I wanna make something from what you're used to, you always be like, no, like you think I won't make it right. I won't, no. won't be authentic, right? <laughs> Anything you you know to do, or you always can do it well, that thing you stick to it. Just, yeah. yeah. But you don't want me practicing on you, right? You know, TZ. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want me TZ, practicing TZ on you. TZ is something like, like if, if you don't do it well. Yeah. The person eat it, it it's so much of pain. Oh really? Okay, yeah. Is it made with like natural ingredients and stuff? If you didn't make it work. Okay, that's what, oh okay. It's, so you it's see edible. so like no problem. You, you can practice. <laughs> but when you practice I will not eat it. It's just not on your time. No. <laughs> Alright, so okay. One of your viewers was asking about uh, us and our own product, the cows and the chickens and the stuff and they're asking it will if we have ever eaten, we've eaten chicken out here before. Remember you slaughtered one for the other channel, but they're asking like, will we be eating our own product? We we can't seem to do that. Yeah. yeah that's a good question because yeah. uh, you can see that we have a lot of animal. Anything I'm raising, they love us and we yeah. love them. We're like greeting them so, every like, morning. They, they love us, how they play with us. They show us love. They, it's they, almost impossible to like just go and be like saying hi mm, to them mm, and then go. The, the yeah. animals love us so much. Yeah, they do. Anytime they see us, they follow us. You know, they yeah. they, 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 they they look our face. They yeah. do different kind of things. Yeah. So I can't. can't eat. Think to do that. We can go and buy. Yeah. Someone's farm. Yeah, which is uh, guinea fowl yeah. or hen or turkey. It's not a problem. To, to, to eat. Yeah, it's but not, not a problem. But we don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Yeah. They don't know us. You yeah. don't know them. Yeah. But your own your, your, your own reason to be happy. Yeah. To be happy. They make yeah. you happy. Yeah. And right now we go outside now. They are flying. They yeah. will do their thing. The duckies yeah. flying to come and meet us. Yeah. They come down, they watch our face and other stuff. How yes. you know I can I can eat that. I can eat that. Me, me I can eat that. And I was I was noticing for a long time that we never really just went out there and just said okay let's have lunch and you never did it and then i remember that one time when i said okay because we don't have no protein and this and that and i was like go get a rooster like we have too many roosters go get one and you were like okay what do you guys do i don't want to tell you 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 want you wanted them to be free you didn't want to go really check because okay. if you really wanted it you would have caught them <laughs> I, I can't eat it because you guys i can't yeah, eat it i, I can't eat any any different kind of chicken and other stuff i, I can't eat my own chicken yeah because you know like the chickens <laughs> we are raising them for farm to do yeah. business yes yeah, so we, do, we raise it's them not a slaughterhouse thank you we yeah. raise them to do business yeah but how we and them are are living even yeah. we don't raise them like a pet but mm -mm. how they, they no. look like a pet that's example. where that's where I so we can't up. eat them you can't that's why i think i messed up in the beginning you remember how i was naming all of the animals yeah. and they were dying and stuff and so i felt yeah. bad so i said i will not name them no more treat yes. them like pets because it's mm -hmm. business so yeah it's business you taught me that and we have a lot of <laughs> we have a lot of uh yeah chickens, can't be naming the cows and big, big chickens <laughs> yeah. and and you know that like yeah. the local chicken mm -hmm. is more costly than the portal farm well i know that now yeah they are very costly than the portal farm thank you for making us rich yes <laughs> that's true. i'm telling you all right so you know like uh the the local ones yeah. uh you can if you want to sell some of them like the the growing ones if you mm. go to market you can buy it 100 cities one mm. but if you look at portal farm how about they sell it 25 oh, 30 cities big one know. i'm pretty sure it's pretty lucrative though if, if you look the if you look the 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 business strategy of, of farming okay uh, 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 chickens 
or yeah. uh, the guinea fowl. Guinea fowls. Yeah. Or poultry farm. Poultry farm. They spend a lot of money for for the for the poultry farm. Okay. With and you know the guinea and other stuff. The guinea fowl, like exporting the guinea fowl to like Europe or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like I did a little research. They're paying like. 50, 40, and 50 euros for the guinea fowl for organic for, or, or grass yeah, we, fed animals. So I'm yeah, just like, whoa, we have is grass fed, yeah. everything is natural here. So, yeah. anyway, Dude. what are we going to have for lunch? Because we just talking. Lunch? Yeah, what do you want? What are we going to eat? <laughs> I'm hungry. Tacos. Uh, Tacos. Tacos. <laughs> Tacos? Okay. Eh? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's not your secret place, okay? Excuse me. That's not your secret place. Okay, so all of this fence here will be raised up, especially in the front for security reasons. Um, it was always planned that way, but uh, we were establishing the farming of the local chickens, so we were just more concerned about keeping them in, and we were able to do that. They still go out. <laughs> some free birds but anyways um the fence will go up and it'll secure the product a little bit more but right next door is also um some land that we have we've decided that we're going to expand on over we weren't going to do that at first but uh, we're going to go ahead and do that because the guinea fowl we thought it would be wise if we move them next door because they are quite vocal they're so loud yeah wow look at the jasmine here so I'm gonna get out here very soon, especially when the rain picks up so that I can clear out all of the debris from all the workers. And once that's done, it's gonna look nice and beautiful. Right now, it still has all of the grasses and stuff from the roofing that was done. Yeah, so we'll definitely take care of that. I love walking under here. It's like being at a fairy castle or something, a fairy village. It's just really cool, guys. I love it. The shade is also very pleasing. Nice and cool. The plants, we have a little bit of work to do to get everything going, making it look really beautiful. So you gotta stick around, make sure that you subscribe so that you do not miss out. Here at our village farm, there's always something to do. And we hope that you will continue to join us on that journey. You are so welcome. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. And remember, we post videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday.